Hey, what's up? This is Todd Smith. I am back with another video. In this video, I want to talk about Behringer and how they just dropped an update on their Wave synthesizer project. The Wave is so, going to be another in massive anticipated PPG clone. I mean, Behringer is really just pumping out the killer big clones that people really, really want. And they state that it is now in beta testing stage, probably has been for a little bit, and it's in the hands of the beta testers right now. Um, they're, you know, giving feedback to Behringer on how good it is, how close it is to the original, which all tells me that this project, the um, Wave project, is getting very close to finished. Um, obviously, I have no connections into the company. I can't give a time frame or anything like that. But usually when we see something of this nature, when they're talking how it's in the beta testers' hands, how they're getting their opinions and stuff like that, that's normally when the project is pretty close to release. So if I had to guess, it'd be the first quarter of next year is when we're going to see the Wave project. So if you've been anticipating the PPG clone from Behringer, know that is definitely probably right around the corner in terms of probably one of the their next big project. I'd imagine after the, you know, UBXA, uh, it looks like the Wave could be the next big keyboard to be hit by Behringer. That they state in the post that it can be hard to make these projects because of some obsolete stuff and stuff they have to recreate because, you know, chips aren't, aren't even made anymore. Um, that they do their best to make it as authentic as possible, which can take extra time because they have to create the technology which has been lost. It's going to be really cool to see how this rolls out. I mean, Behringer is really just stepping it up. They showed the Jupiter clone that's in early stages yesterday. The UBXA is now starting to get the, in the hands of some people. It is um, now available to order on stores. And now they're saying that the Wave is in beta testing stage. It's going to probably be very close to release in terms of, again, I'd probably guess first quarter of next year. So if you, those big keyboard projects, if you were kind of bored of the monos and um, were more excited about the polys and the big keyboard projects, I think next year, in these next few years actually, are going to be a huge year for you and you're going to be pretty happy. I'm not sure how many I'm going to need. We'll see. Time will tell on that. Um, would the PPG Wave clone be something that you are interested in? And what is the price point you'd like to see it at if you are planning to buy this machine? I would love to know your opinion. And as always, stay positive, stay creative, support each other. Peace.